converting Figma to React.js is very easy to do. Today I am going to show you how to do it. First, open your Figma account. If you are here for the first time, sign up for it. Otherwise, log into your account. On the main Figma dashboard, you will find several options. The left panel contains layers and assets. In the top middle, you can see the name of your file. On the right panel, you can find various options like design, prototype, colors, etc. To add plugins, go to the top left navigation bar and click on the plugins button in the top left corner. Search for Anima. It will show you that Anima can convert your Figma designs or components into interactive and responsive React components in developer mode. You can bookmark this plugin and copy the link to share. Click on Run to install it. It will take some time to install and activate. After activation, a login page will appear. Click on Login to Anima. Next, click on Login with Google. These are straightforward steps. After this, it will load the screen for you. Answer any questions it asks. After completing the questions, click on Back to Figma to return to the Figma screen. Now, Anima will ask you to choose an option. It's up to you whether you want to click on Manage Design Systems or Turn Design to Code. Simply click on your choice. Now you'll be on the main screen where the magic happens. You'll see many options like responsive pages, entrance animation, hover effect, media element, text input, submit button, embed code, etc. On the top right section, you'll see the get code and preview button. First, click on the frames for which you want to get the code. After selecting frames, click on get the code in the top right corner. It will ask you which framework you prefer. Choose React.js. Now, it will take some seconds to generate the code for you. Be patient as the speed may depend on your network or data. The browser will open, and you will see the main dashboard of Anima. There, you can see the code of the frame you selected. To export the code, simply click on Export Code in the top right corner, and you will get a zip file of the code. 